Hello, in this video, we are going to evaluate with our calculator. This is 3 to the power of 13 minus 3 to the power of 11. Now, I'm going to start by expressing this 13 as summation of 10 and 3, and also express 11 as summation of 10 and 1. So this will give me 3 power 10 plus 3. Minus 3 power 10 plus 1. Now, if you have a power x plus y, this equals a power x times a power y. So, applying this right here, I have 3 power 10 times 3 power 3 minus 3 power 10 times 3 power 1. So, what we are going to do will be to factor out the common term that is 3 power 10. You have 3 power 10 times this divides 3 power 10. You have 3 power 3 minus this divides 3 power 10. We have 3. So from here, we have 3 power 10 times 3 power 3, that is 27 minus 3. So from here, I have 3 power 10 times 27 minus 3, that is 24. So from here, what I'm going to do will be to find out the value of 3 power 10. If I have 3 to the power of 10, this is just like writing 3 to the power of 5 times 2. And if you have a power x times y, this is just like writing a power x to the power of y. Applying this here, that means 3 power 10 is the same as writing 3 power 5 to the power of 2. And from here, we have 3 power 10 equals 3 power 5. 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 to the power of 2. 3 times 3 is 9 times 3 27 times 3 81 times 3 is 243. 3 power of 2. So, to find the square of this, you have 243 times 243. I multiply out. So, I'm going to start by using 3 to multiply everything here. 3 times 3, 9. 3 times 4, 12. 2 carry over 1. 3 times 2, 6 plus 1. 7. 4 times 3, 12, 2 carry over 1. 4 times 4, 16 plus 1, 17, 7 carry over 1. 4 times 2, 8 plus 1, 9. Then I consider 2. 2 times 3, 6. 2 times 4, 8. 2 times 2, we have 4. So let's add up. This is 9. 42029 add here 19 then this is 59499 so this is 59499 times 24 so let's multiply this out to get our final answer 5949 times 24. So we are going to start by using 4 to multiply the numerator. So we have 4 times 9, that is 36. 6 carry over 3. 4 times 4, 16 plus 3, 19. 9 carry over 1. 4 times 0, 0, 0 plus 1. We have 1. 
4 times 9 again 36. So what we do is we have 6 and carry over our third. 4 times 5, that is 20. 20 plus 3, that is 23. So we proceed to using 2. 2 times 9, 18. 8 carry over 1. 2 times 4, 8 plus 1. We have 9. 2 times 0, 0. 2 times 9, 18 carry over 1. 2 times 5, 10. Plus 1, we have 11. So the next step will be to add up these together. This 6, we bring it down here. 9 plus 8, that will give you 17. So you have 7. And carry over 1 and add here. This becomes 2. When you add 2 to 9, you have 11. That means you keep right 1 and carry over 1. And you add this 1 to this 6, this becomes 7 plus 0. That is 7. Then you proceed to 3, 3 plus 8. This will give you 11 again. You have 1. And carry over 1, add to 2, that becomes 3. So 3 plus 1, you have 4. And this one here, you bring it down here. So the answer here is 1417176. So from here, we have this as 1,417,176. So that becomes the answer for 3 power 13 minus 3 power 11. This equals 1 million. 417,176. And we have achieved this without the use of calculator or was reverse. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you and see you in our next video. Thank you. Special shout out to all the ones that have been dropping messages. I appreciate you all. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.